Yep, hello guys, yet an another interesting rose of tutorial. Today we're gonna be continuing our hacking ep expedition with Backtrack 4. It's pretty amazing. So without even wasting any any other time, we're gonna be looking at how to use the set uh, the set tools or the social engineering toolkit. So I'll just navigate to my to my pen test sorry pen test exploit right I would love it to see it just right here so having got that done I need to download it because I don't have it and I'm going to use a very nice command that comes uh, with backtrack mm. CTP slash V that now this is this is just a uh, uh what so sure slash engineering engineering slash toolkit yeah so I hit enter and I'll wait for a couple of minutes so there we have it it's done and uh, I just go ahead and clear up uh, try to look at it and uh, this is what we have right so uh, uh, that's it uh, we have our settings say there you can update it if you want to but since I just got it I don't see any need for that so I go ahead and start up the set and uh, what I'm going to what we're going to be looking at today first is our uh, web attacks so I hit 2 and this is pretty simple seriously even though you're a newbie hacker uh, this is pretty simple for you to do. It's not something that you can uh, be like, wait a minute, uh, this is so hard for me to do. It's it's something that's so easy, and I'm going to still choose our Shikita Ganya. So for how many times I wanted to to uh, encode uh, my, the, my pillow, <laughs> excuse me, four times, and uh, yes, I do need it. No, uh, the, uh, I need an, an IP, and that's uh, my IP. So the IP for my machine. If I I was to go in here and make an if config minus a, you can see this is my IP. So I'll just go in here. Let's go in here. 192.68.29.128 hopefully that's it so I'm just going to run it on port 444 and start it so when it's done I have I say yes I need to receive my uh, uh, the, pay the payload and uh, there it goes easy and simple and then it starts for us a shell that is going to uh, to listen to uh, the outside world. All right, let me just try to. So once we have a shell ready and running, because you see it has the our playload uh, playload handler has already started. So how about we try to go to the other machine to see what we have, right? Remember that this is our this is our this is our. Uh, the, the victims machine and uh, today it happens to be uh, the FBI oh my goodness look at these guys <laughs> okay I'm not going to spend a lot of time on this but uh, assuming we get that it's, it's all about you to do some little some little shush, uh, some little uh, social engineering to uh, persuade the person or the victim to, uh, to, to type in your link so that you can uh, and that's this link uh, your, your your IP the port that the IP that is listening so that you can get him, right? So as it goes, shows like nothing has happened. You wait for a minute, and it looks machine. Wow! Well, 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 well. We already have a met a metapretious shell session one. It's open to this port. Wow. Okay. So uh, how about we try to see what we have? in a jackpot so we start we start a sessions minus i mm, I say it's invalid okay we shall go with our sessions minus i1 so it says starting interactions with one 
as a, and that's the, our victim so it opens up and uh, how about we use our use pre right and uh, it's loading our extension it's successful okay then this is getting exciting we get a hash dump how about to try to get the hash dump of all the users passwords uh, the users passwords that are on that machine well oh my oh my god look at this uh huh let's try to look closer before we get excited this is the administrator this is her mm -hmm. I see crystal I see the guest I see hacker I see assistant and you know what if you were to copy some of these and you try to google them you would get the exact passwords there and then so but uh we don't still have the machine as, as in it's still so far away from from us what what else can we do how about we try to see whether we can get the shell the CMD shell from that computer so we execute we execute minus F for the CMD.exe and then we want it to be interactive that is a minus I minus H enter well bingo <laughs> here we have it so if I try to run my uh, uh, oh sorry <laughs> IP config IP config slash all right well mm -hmm. so can we see this look at this this is running at a at that 130 <laughs> this is another IP dude this is amazing and if you try to make her die as such hmm, well that looks like desktop uh, you remember these weird files of Osama bin Laden? If we were to go inside our, say, oh guys, I think uh, this is this is nothing. There is nothing, nothing more you you can uh, you can want more than just getting a shell. Cause roughly right here we can uh, just start a. Uh, we can transfer netcat we can uh, start up a service we can just write a batch a, a batch file that can uh, uh, can uh, make a port open for us we can just add a user we can remove a user wow the possibilities are endless so guys try it out but for me game is over Tee.